The second game of our NEC Tournament semifinal doubleheader. The seven-seeded Robert Morris Colonials visiting the top-seeded Mount St. Mary's Mountaineers. John Stewart, one of them, and just got the handoff from Aaron Tate. Swatted down low by Chris Ray, but Matty McConnell, the great steal the other way, hands it off and Tate finishes. Ray, he's a lot taller than Tate, but Tate a fierce defender. Hits the lefty hook with the ultra-quick Junior Robinson. Gets around him with the scoop. It's in that game, shooting six of nine from behind the arc. Underneath, Alexander, and it counts. He's back in now, and Long settles for the three. Stewart to the rim. Greg Alexander, stop and pop for three. Rebound, Miles Wilson after the nice pass from the Wandu. Great offensive possession for Robert Morris, but a great defensive one for Mount. And Greg Alexander hits the triple, his first of the game. We talk about guards rebounding, one of my favorite all time, Tony Lee from Robert Morris. Was year in and year out in the NEC. Clive Allen with the tough drive to the basket. Now Ray, they switch Burke on the Robinson. Defends it well, but he hits the layup and the foul. Leads back down to three. Long tries to answer. He does. Protects the ball from Chris Ray, who almost gets the steal. Clive Allen to the basket and the foul. Eight earlier, they end up benefiting and making a five point run. Best game you lose is a microcosm of Great the season. Alexander, the offensive rebound puts it back to the ground. Long gets it. Up ahead to Junior Robinson. To the basket. Finishes. Six point lead from Mount St. Mary's. Timeout on the floor. And it's going to be Robert Moore's basketball. Wow. And Mount St. Mary's will be hosting their first ever NEC championship game here at the Knott Arena. They defeat Robert Moore 75 to 66.